Number 57. Calculate the ionization constant for each of the following acids or bases from the ionization constant of its conjugate base or conjugate acid. Then we have letter B. So in this case, we have NH4, and we want to find the ionization constant for that, right? But the first thing is, is NH4 plus an acid or a base? Well, generally, if you see a positive sign, that means that you're dealing with an acid. So... If we're dealing with an acid, we want to solve for the Ka value, A for acid. So I went to the back of a textbook, and I found the conjugate base for NH4+. Conjugate bases, remember, you drop one of the hydrogens, so this would be NH3. And there's the base value, Kb is 1.8 times 10 to the negative fifth. So in this case, we just want to go from a Kb to a Ka. Any formulas come into mind? of how to convert from a Kb to a Ka? Yeah, there's one of them, and it's this one right here. Kw equals Ka times Kb. Now, just for simplicity of this video, right, let's just pretend we want to solve for Ka, right? And that's essentially what we want to do. So if we want to solve for Ka, what we would do is we would divide by Kb on both sides. So if I just kind of bring this over, just to make it a little bit easier for us, it would be Kw divided by Kb. Now, you could just use that one formula to solve, but it's just easier for me to just use one formula and do the math there. But either way, you'll get the same answer. Now, Kb values or Ka values at the back of the book is at 25 degrees Celsius, room temp. So that means that you should memorize the Kw uh, number. Kw, W stands for water. The ionization constant for water is 1.0 times 10 to the negative 14th at room temp. And we know what this is now, 1.8 times 10 to the negative 5th, and that's going to equal our Ka. So Ka equals um, something divided by something, 1.0 times 10 to the negative 14th, and then the base was 1.8 times 10 to the negative fifth, and let's do it. Ka equals 1 times 10 to the negative 14th divided by 1.8 times 10 to the negative fifth, and two sig figs, so 5.6, right? Two sig figs, yeah. 5.6 times 10 to the negative tenth, and there you go. That is your corresponding Ka for NH4+. That's it, guys. That's all I got. Stick around because we'll be doing letter C next in a little bit. If you guys are on the playlist, hang tight. I will see you there. If you want to press the subscribe button in the meantime, that would mean the world to me. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in a little bit. Bye-bye.